that's how we do it in my garden. That's how we do it in my garden. That's how we do it in my garden.
I pressed the wrong button. I'm sorry. I'm really, so I'm really sorry. I, I pressed intermission and not. I was sorry. Let's should we try that again? Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna try that again. There we go. Hey, how's it going, everybody? Oh my God. Happy, happy Banuka month, happy Bandicoot month, and happy Pride month, which I didn't realise was um, also June. I, that's news to me, but there you go. I guess um, um, Crash is very gay, I suppose. Um, well, I don't know, is he? It's, it's none of my business. I'll, I'll be real. It's none of my business. But um, before we begin, uh, first of all, too loud? Yeah, I thought so. Yeah. Okay, I'm turning it down. Okay, how's, how's the volume there? How's the volume there? Unfortunately, I can't actually hear how it sounds. Um, German boy Remy, thank you for the sub. Pale Wavy, thank you for the sub. German uh, German boy Remy, thank you also for 250 bits. Um, Ewan Wade White, sorry, thank you for subbing. Sad Matt boy, thank you for subbing. Twitch That's bro, thank you. Oh god, garden. stop it, guys. I've, okay, I've lost the beginning, people. I'm so sorry. I can't read your names because you've gone off of my screen. Matt L99, thank you for the sub. That's Twitch bro, thank you for garden. the resub. And the Pleb Lewis, thank you for the resub. Um. And, oh god, now I've got all the people that... Oh jeez, now I've got all the people that haven't been on my stream for a while because they're only interested in the retro stuff and um, they have no idea why, I, why why my face cam has gone. Oh, God's sake. Well, I'm not going... I, I, I go over this a million times, so I'm just going to um, let the chat fill everyone in. So, anyway, we are in um, June tradition, carrying on with the Crash series in chronological order. We have 100%ed Crash 1, Crash 2, Crash 3, including Platinum Relics and Crash 3. And now we're on to Crash Team Racing, the original one. Um, this is being played directly from my PS2. This is a direct PS2 capture with a, um, a HDMI upscaler called an OSSC, which is Open Source Scan Converter, I think it's called. I'm not sure. But as you can see, this memory card already has the scrapbook unlocked. So this is definitely from my old days of playing this game when I was a kid. Um, do you know what? Shall we just for the laughs? What? Oh. Well, then how have I got the scrapbook, then? Well, that, that doesn't make any sense. What? Wait, this is the... Wait, 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 wait. Does it... When you unlock it, does it unlock forever? I don't remember. That's how we do it in my garden. Rathman, thank you for resubbing. Yeah, this is... And that's why the loading times are a little bit weird and there's going to be a bit of... Oh, have, have the, uh, I don't think the disc wants to load this. Oh, no. No, the disc is not... Yeah, this is being played directly from the disc. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, we were doing so well. Well, we, we hadn't even started, but there you go. Yeah, this is this is this is the, the 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 disc is a bit old. It's a bit scratched. Twitch bro, thank you um, for the two hundred bits. Bandicoot month, can't believe it's June already. Thank you um, for that. Um, okay, um, okay, um, Amy, can you go to the PS two, please? I don't know what that one is. The one with the green light. Right. Yeah. And just tap the green light for me, please. Oh, God. You just have to press it once, and then it will reset. Oh, God. It's just a little button where the it's on the green light. It's yeah, yeah, on, it's on the green light, so just press it in once, and it will reset. It, I, I don't know if I pressed it. What do you mean you don't know if you pressed it? You either pressed <laughs> it or you didn't. No, no push, push it in, push it in. Push it in? Yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. Oh, okay. Is that it? Has it gone red? Yeah. Well, you pressed it too hard, then. Oh, sorry. Uh, well, you, you just, I said press it. I said press it. <laughs> Well, you didn't, did you? Press it like a normal person. Okay, is it green now? No. What are you doing, Amy? It's green, and she pressed it again. I pressed it! It's green, it's green, it's green. Right, are we on? It's got a nice thing. Yay! Thanks, Amy. Yay! That's how we do it in my I was really garden. worried that that was going to completely glitch out the stream, to be honest, because of the signal changes, but it's okay. Cameron Bly, thank you for 200 bits. I've been replaying Crash Bandicoot games, but my PS2 won't read my PS1 discs anymore. Get another PS2 then. Um, Beard and his kekers, thank you for the five month in a row um, resub. I shall mosh for your honour. Oh, thank you. Anyway, we're starting from the beginning now. Oh yeah, Americans out there, you never would have heard this. Listen. Start your engines. Sony Computer Entertainment Europe production. 
because I, I know this game from emulation back in the day and from what I see from people's videos online that everyone I've seen Solo Computer Entertainment America Productions and uh, you never see the Europe anymore. So that's fun. Uh, this is bring this is bringing me back. Oh, there they came. They all came out the box. In fact, could we say, seeing as it's Pride Month, they all came out of the closet? All of them at once? They all fell out? Oh, there's no one. Oh, okay. We can play in Italiano. Or Netherlands. <laughs> or... <laughs> Let's go with English. That's probably a good idea, isn't it? Here he is. Yeah, this is not the P this is not the PS4 remake. This is where it all started. This is the first one, the original one, the fun one. Not that the, no, the new one's fun as well. I'm kidding, but yeah, let's do this then. I don't know why the scrapbook's unlocked if I haven't got any save data on here that is old save data. But there you go, whatever. Adventure. How do we get the the first cutscene up? Is it does it go with the adventure mode when we hit new game? I don't want to miss the first cutscene. Let's see. Okay, well, the, the scrapbook didn't load. Hopefully the game itself will load. Oh, maybe maybe we don't get to see the cutscene. Oh, you just wait? Oh, damn it, you're kidding. Okay, well, let's go back to the menu. We have to watch the, the cutscene. We have to get the full experience. This is a 100% playthrough, I'll have you know. So we have to make sure it's right. So we just need to sit around and wait. I'll go to the chat for a second. How are we doing, everybody? Do I call it Lilac Wars? No, it's Star Fox. Lilac Wars is annoying as shit. Um, it's after you select your character? No, I, I, more people are saying, um, more people are saying, go to the main menu, leave it on the main menu, so I, I will. Cash Banuka Tim's Race. No, that's not right. It's actually Cash Teat Rabies, I'll have you know. Oh. That's having some water. If you don't have the water, have your water. Well, yeah, you're right, Linderoo. You do unlock that by doing all of the um the stuff, but I haven't got a save file on this memory card that has that. So what I'm wondering is, once you've unlocked it once, does it then matter if you get rid of the de the data or not? As long as you've got the data, it doesn't matter what progress your save file's on. Greetings, creatures of this world. Now, this is the better Oxide voice, in my opinion. So, you pesky earth like to raise, eh? <laughs> well, this used to scare me when I was a kid. I mean, I mean, he's awful. I travel the but that music is really fucked up as well. Test my skills. It's a little game I call Survival of the Fastest. Here's the way we He sounds play. like Debbie Harry. <laughs> the best driver of why, why? To race oh, the no, no. If your driver wins, I'll leave your miserable little rock alone. But if I win, I'll turn your entire globe into a concrete. Why is his mouth a bagpipe? Make you my slave. It's very it's very flexible. I forgot how flexible it was. I always thought my childhood memory was that he just moved bread. his mouth, not the entire snout. That's disgusting. Alison Inc, thank you for 210 bits. I got Hogs of War and this for my birthday. Best new game days ever. Oh, that's cool. Sad Matt Boy, thank you for 200 bits. Super hyped for this. CT on the remaster, my favorite games of all time. Went through the insanity of getting that every damn Nitro Fuel developer times took at least 16 years of my life. Yeah, I don't I don't want to do that. Whoa, close graphics. Oh, Polar's reading the book upside down. No, Eevee's coming up. Yeah, Purr is Eevee. Yeah. Oh, there's Dingadar. Does he get blown up? Oh, yeah, he does. So they remade that in the PS4 version as well. Oh, there's Mr. Gums. The, the, the lesser known brother of Jaws. That's how we do it in my garden. Thank you, Spooky Trixie, for the gifted sub. And Tarek, or uh, Tar Tar Tarek? I'm not sure. Tech? I'm not sure. Thank you for the sub. Louis is big and long. 300 bits. Thank you so much. Would you recommend an, an OSSC for PS2? I'm using it right now, so you tell me. If it looks good to you, go for it. It's an awesome bit of kit. It's expensive, but it's worth it. Um, I'm considering getting one for the PS2 and GameCube. Not sure if I can justify the price. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Anyway, adventure mode, new game. Start from the beginning. We've uh, I've done all the platinum relics and shit before, um, and I've done them multiple times on the Vita um, when this was on the PS Store, and um, 
also with um, the PS4 remake, as you've seen from the video, so it should be too hard. Um, now, I can't rem My go-to is tiny. My, go my go-to is usually tiny. I prefer having the speed. Uh, but then he is quite bulky and hard to see around. Um... Okay, I'll let you guys decide. Um, I'll let you guys. Can someone start a poll in the chat? I would love. Um, I don't, I would love someone to start a poll of um, who should I be for the speed character? Should I be Dingadile or Tiny? Because Tiny is my is, Tiny is my main man. He's the one I go to. He's my loincloth wearing baby. I, the, he's the one that like I immediately go to. It's not all of it was not wrong, and I also love Tiny because. Dingo, di everyone's saying Dingadile. That's surprising. Dingadile, Dingadile, Dingadile. Well, now I feel sorry for Tiny. No, I'm not playing as Crash. I'm not playing as anybody other than the speed characters. Dingo, 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 Tiny, Tiny, Dingadile, Tiny, Tiny. But now all the Tinies are coming back in. Oh, oh, current poll, who play? That's the name of the poll that's going on in chat right now. Okay, let's have a look. I'm gonna see I'm gonna see how this is going. So, Dingo the Wingo or Tiny the Tiny is 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 who we're fighting against. Um creeping up at 68% with 48 votes is Dingo the Wingo. Coming up to 69, the funny number. 68 people, 85 people have voted for Dingo Dala, 40 training behind on Tiny Tiger. Tiny Tiger hasn't got a chance of catching up at this point, but it's anyone's game at this point. Well, it's not anyone's game, it's the Dingo's game, really. But maybe Tiny can be the black horse and come out of No, that's not Dark Horse, not Black Horse, Dark Horse. And he can he can creep up from the back of the of the railing. But no, the the, the back creep up from the back of the pack and then uh, I, this is why I don't do dog racing commentary. Oh, Tiny is Tiny is really creeping up. I think Dingo's going to win out, though. And the poll lasts a couple of more seconds. And who won? Dingo the Wingo. There you go. It's been decided by chat. Ah. Uh, oh, and I went right past him. Of course I did. I've never played as Dingadile. Never played as him. Um, his name is. His name is Gimpo. And I'm gonna take over my Cortex save. I'm overwriting Caddy with Gimpo. There we go. Oh my god. Save completed. Big flashy letters. Oh, back in the day when saving was an event. Um, MEK Simon, thank you for $2. I was trying to do a live stream of Man of Medan, but it turns out my Xbox One needed an update as well as the game with whopping 22 gigabytes. Next game with Final Fantasy Remake instead. Yeah, I don't blame you. Oh yes, and we get Uka Uka talking to us. Welcome to the Adventure Arena. You can travel around this area and practice your driving skills. The Is that still Clancy Brown? Map. I'm not sure. Yeah, well, no, I mean, it would be. It... I don't know if he was clash, voicing him at this point. It signifies they are open to play. Yeah, it sounds more like Mr. Krabs now. He doesn't sound anything like he does in Crash 3. Pad that has an active warp vortex, and it will take you to the track start line. Finish the start line? Place to win a trophy. As you collect more trophies, other tracks will turn on and Oh, shut up. <laughs> right, um, how do we get... Oh, God! Why has Dingadar got shit all over his back? Oh, he looks awful. Right, how do we get the camera angle? That's better. You can't play you can't play Crash Team Racing with the camera right up their butts. It doesn't work like that. Anyway, I think what we're gonna do, we're gonna go through each race in story order. Just in normal in normal story order, and then we'll go back through the game and get the we'll get all the tokens and the relics and shit. Otherwise we're gonna get fed up of playing the same levels over and over again. Holy shit, there's 600 of you. God. Thanks for thanks for joining in, everybody. Yeah, I, I was I do feel sorry for Tiny not being picked because um because um yeah, I mean, he's all, he I mean, he's my baby first of all, but also because um Oh god. Oh, getting used to this after playing the PS4 version for so long is a bit bit unorthodox, but I'm sure I'll get the hang of it. How do we use items again? Okay, it's not that one. <laughs> um, it's circle? Yes, it's circle. Okay. 
Oh, I think I must have hit Cortex. Sorry. Okay, right. Oh, it feels good to be playing this. And the vibrations on the DualShock um, 2 are fantastic. Oh, I forgot. Okay, I'm a bit rusty. Just give me just give me a sec. I don't remember the track layouts massively at this point. And I'm still kind of going off of the PS4 rules, which is uh, a, little, a little bit unfair to this game because this is the first one, but there you go. Let's get a shield up anyway. I don't think in this one, the higher you jump... Oh, maybe the higher you... Yeah, no, the higher you jump, the more boost you get, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. There we go. There we go. That's better. Whee! Ah, right, off this way. Hope the volume... And I, and I, do you know what sucks about kart racing games? Well, any racing game, I suppose, is that I can't interact with the chat while I'm in a lap. Um, it doesn't really... It doesn't really work unless I'm, like, on a straight, like, right now. You're waiting for the Crash Bash 100% stream. Oh, oh, so am I. I'm not looking forward to it. I mean, th this is not the biggest game in the world, so I'm thinking that um, we're going to be uh, done with the 100 Like, the tricky bit will be the Platinum Relics, but once we're done with that, um, I think Crash Bash will be played this month, I'm pretty sure. Because um, we got through the entire trilogy last year, so maybe we'll, we'll get through a couple of more games this year. So yeah, we've got this, and then we've got Crash Bash. And then we've got Wrath of Cortex after that. So the, ne the next two games after this are not going to be the most enjoyable. Um, Narcissistic Brit, thank you for the resub for five months. I um, haven't played the original CTR in a while. Hope you're having a brilliant night, mate. Thank you again for the fantastic entertainment. Thank you so much. <laughs> um, that, sorry, that was, that was her face that was scaring me. There's supposed to be music here, isn't there? This is awkward. Oh, there it is. Ah, uh, the joys of playing with an old scratchy disc. Why is Ding Why is Dingadar got a trumpet head for a mouth? It looks like if, every time he jumps up, it looks like he should be going. He's got like he's got like a triangular pizza mouth. What is that? Congratulations! Congratulations! Dingadar, me boy, you got the trophy. Yeah, can we just skip your bullshit? Thanks. To hear this hint again, oh, press the start collect, button and choose the, the Uka Uka hit. I've got a bit of a luck jaw problem. <laughs> right, let's continue. Next race. That was pretty, pretty fucking easy. If you know, what, you know what I mean, saying so. I'm gonna eat my words, aren't I? But there you go. Sorry, we've got um, 200 bits. Thank you for um, from t for Twitch, bro. Thank you. See, they see the way they you said the file's name is like watching a proper live caddy episode instead of a recorded version on YouTube. <laughs> Thank you, Caboose. Fifteen, two hundred bits. Bits for the first one of the evening. Thank you so much. Well, there's going to be a lot more, so um, I won't complain if you send bits for every win. That's that's fine with me. Oh, I forgot. Good. We did. We did good. I, I we have to, I have to remind everybody we did good. Harper, thank you for 200 bits. Hey, Kelly Keris, whoever else is present, hope you're well and happy. Happy Pride from a trans woman. Hope you played Crash on the Run and what are your thoughts on it? I'm not telling you because that's part of the next video. Only a tiny part, though. I have played a lot of it, though. I forgot to get the super boost, but it's okay. Do you know I didn't, I didn't know about the super boost until Nitro Fuel? Because I, because I had no idea what the, what the trophy... It, like, there's a, there's, a, there's a PlayStation trophy, um... Um, associated with getting a load of with starting the races with a certain amount of perfect boosts or something or maybe it was for the um oh god this feels different from the ps4 version um yeah there we go but it's a bit slipperier it's a bit looser oh careful guys you're gonna hit the microphone sorry i gotta move the microphone phoebe walked into it with her stupid body right let's go yeah, I had no idea that super boosting was a thing, but until um, it was the one per coin challenges, wasn't it? It was the it was the daily challenges where it's like, oh, start five races with a perfect boost, and I had absolutely no idea what that meant, and I had to look it up. And then I was like, oh, that's something from the original. I'm pretty sure that's never explained once. They explain how how to um, they explain how to do um, um regular starting boosts, but not um. Yeah, not the super boosts. Final lip. You also don't jump anywhere near as high on this one as you do on the original on the remake as well. 
So I'm still kind of playing with um, PS4 rules, which is not the best idea on a PS1 game. <laughs> Still good. It still looks great after all these years, though. Like, the, the graphical effects on the water there are as impressive then as the, um, as the new ones are on, on the remake now. There we go. Not too bad. See, you wouldn't be able to get... Because you can't do the big old ultra-nuclear boost um, that you can do in Nitro Fuel. So, going over that shortcut area on the left before the before the start line is not recommended on this version because you can't really get massive massive ultra super blue flame boosts that can cut through a lot of the rough terrain you kind of only have regular boosts i think you can get a, a, a super boost i'm not sure i don't remember here she comes here she comes ah! yeah, th th those models didn't age well i am the twig thank you for sub Ah, oh, there he goes. Um, ba Baguette, yes, yeah, subscribe. Thank you so much. I am the Twig, subscribe. Did I say that? Thank you. Um, Sonic Wolf, thank you for 500 bits. Happy Bandicunf. <laughs> I shut him up before he could even open his mouth. Before the game could even load the disc. <laughs> I bitch slapped him back to fucking hell. Where 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 does he come from? I don't know. Hello. That's how we do it in my M Glitch garden. Gaming. Thank you for 500 bits. This is going to be fun. I've never unlocked all the characters without the cheat code. Now thanks to Nitro Fueled, I did it. Have a happy bandy month. Thank you so much. Starlight Alchemist. Thank you for resubbing for nine months. Got a crash themed joke for you. What do you get when you mix crash and a trumpet? Crash banditoot. I know it's bad. I apologize. Um, you should apologise, and also what's pretty bad is that the starting line music didn't start until the race had already begun. Um, my copy, like I said, is um, pretty, pretty festy. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, engine's in front, and that's, that's not good enough. We can't be having that. God, this feels so different from the... Uh, I keep trying to say the original. This feels so different from the... Um, uh, from the um, remake. Yeah, we can keep a string of boosts going, but I don't think you can ever stack powerful boosts on top of each other. I think you can just keep the length of the boost high, but not in improve the power of it like you can in the in the remake. I'm pretty confident in saying that. There we go. Yeah. Do you know what? All this time I thought they were like accordions. When I was a kid, I thought they were accordions. No, they're turtles. They've got little faces. Yeah, look, look, see, see. Yeah, I, I didn't know that until I played the remake, and then I played, and then I played this again for some reason, and I noticed it, and I was like, oh my god. Yeah, I, I thought that I thought they were um, accordions or like springs or something. I mean, dead giveaways that they didn't make up when you jumped on them, so they definitely were not accordions. But you know, game still feels great to play though. It's a, it's a bit, yeah, like I said, it's a bit slipperier and a bit looser than the remake, but um, it still feels good. I'd rather play this over um, Diddy Kong Racing anyway. I'm sorry, honey. Diddy Kong Racing's great. I really like it, but this is this is better. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It just is. No debate. No debate. I'm, I'm so confident in what I'm saying that I'm not even looking at the chat to see the argument that's happening right now. Oh, that was okay. I deserved that. At least I got a boost. Okay, that was that was fair. I was that was fair. The rare the rareware gods heard me and they struck me down. That's fine. That's fine. I, you did speak to the rare helpline, and then you met the voice of Whizpig at Magfest, and then you told him that you that you made he made you cry when you were a kid, and he found that very funny. Oh. We made it anyway. It's fine. Ooh, there we go. Next race. We're, we're breezing through these. Watch an artist. Thank you for 200 bits. Happy Bandicoot month. Also, just joined the patron in Discord. Ah, oh, thanks. That's so kind of you. Posted some Banuka art I've done in there in celebration. Oh, that's that's really nice. Thank you. Also, we won, we won another race. Good. That's good. 
These awkward silences are horrible. They they included them as races in the remake. Oh, ni nice view, Polar. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Baby polar bear anus. That's exactly what I... Yeah. Just, sp just spread out. That's yeah, I'm with Cortex here. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want you to look up there. Congratulations. Oh, am I going to make him appear and then go away again? Baby Viking Games, thank you for the sub. Can I make him go away before he speaks? You can get a no! Oh, I gave the, the skip didn't work. Ah, oh, the game hadn't loaded enough yet. Oh! You must have a boss key to open this door. Nice, thanks. You must have balls to play this game. Ah. Anyway, we haven't we haven't had any use for the fail or the death. Actually, we're not going to have a death thing, are we? That's that's not relevant in this game. I guess if I fall down a hole or I lose against a boss, uh, I, I, I'll count as a loss. Thank you, Cameron Blythe, for 200 bits. What's Keris's history with Crash Bandicoot? What's her favorite game in the series? She doesn't have one, and she doesn't have one. <laughs> no, yeah, I know, I know, you haven't got any history with it, though, do you? No. So there you go. No, she has no history with it, and I don't think you've got a favorite one, have you? Oh, favorite one to watch at least, because you play. You, we played the we played the remake of this quite a lot. Well, we used to anyway before we moved on to other things. Yeah. How about Insane Trilogy? You've enjoyed watching that or Crash Four? Did you enjoy watching Crash Four? I was getting angry with Crash Four. Yeah. Crash 4 was quite stressful, actually, now that you... Uh... See, Keris has an interesting um, perspective as a spectator. She doesn't... She's not as much of a player as anyone else in the house is. So her, her, her opinion comes from more of a, can I sit down and watch this as entertainment? Oh, can I make it? Yeah! Whee! Oh, it's so much fun. Um... Uh, get out, get out, get out! Jeez, I just, I just looked at the map. How far am I ahead? My god. Oh god. Oh god. Do you know what, as well, is that I'm playing this with, um, um, Crash Nitro Kart slash Nitro Fuel. Um, fuck, 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 fuck. How do I reverse? How do I reverse? Why is it not reversing? Oh, you have to press down. Well, that's fun. You have to press down to reverse. What kind of backwards Billy Bollock bullshit is that? Uh. Okay, there we go. Oh, I'm gonna get squished. Oh. Yeah, I'm, I'm playing with the, I'm playing with the drifting. I'm playing with the drifting with the same rules as Nitro Kart and the remake. Where it's like the longer you leave it, the better boost you get. But I'm pretty sure in this version it doesn't work like that. You just wait for the wait for the burnout to occur and then just hit the boost. And so that's you just wait for the black smoke to come out the back of the car. That's your, there's your visual indication of when you should boost. I'm pretty sure it's not as immaculate as um, Nitro Fueled in that regard. Good. No, Square didn't do it. No, Square did not work. Square did not do it. Can we say Cash Januka or is it too much? Yeah, I, I prefer Bandicunth, to be honest. I find that funnier. Ah, there we go. Right, another one. Another one bites the dust. Another one guy, another one guy, another one bangy teeth. There he is. Is he going to say anything? Ripperoo, why aren't you saying anything? Ripperoo, why aren't you saying. No! That was not supposed to happen. <laughs> that was not supposed to happen. He was supposed to talk immediately. That was terrifying. Oh, it's Ripper Roo's Rallenge. Let's go. Oh, that was that was terrifying. He was just staring. It was just like that was just the biggest stink eye I've ever seen anyone like. 
He was sizing me up. He was like performing like psychological warfare on me. He was interrogating me. I would have committed to a murder I didn't commit under that gaze. Right, once you get ahead of the bosses, they're no problem, but getting ahead, ahead of them is kind of a problem, so... Yeah, thought that would happen already. No, come on! Jesus Christ, you need to jump a lot more. Oh! No! Okay, right. Go. No! Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is very, very bad. Okay, I just need to get right up behind him before I um, think about using a missile. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, yep. Oh, you little rag. Ah. Okay, there we go. I did it. I did it. I did it. I'm ahead. I'm ahead. I just need to stay ahead now. Um, he's a kangaroo. Yeah. I don't even know if TNT's hurt him. I think he's immune. He's immune to the thing that he shits out. Ah! I mean, maybe, maybe... Oh, Jesus, that... I floated off a little bit there. Oh, my God. All I can do is just stay ahead. I should probably be looking behind me, but... Oh, this is close. Oh, I got him! Oh, he's not immune to TNT. Oh, I've won the way. Oh, I've won the waste. I've, I've, I've won the waste then. Everybody whap it up. I've won the waste. Everybody away for me. Yes. Celebrations. Congratulation. I win the waste again with a woo. Pop, 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 pop. Uh, Braxton, thank you for one dollar. That's kind of you. Happy Bandicoot Month. My favorite game, my favorite time of the year. Nitro Field is probably the best crash racing game I've played. Most followed by Tag Team Racing, then Nitro Kart, then Original CTR. Ooh, you're going to start an argument in the chats for that. There we go. And, um... And this is why you don't fuck with me, because when, when I'm through with you, I kill you, skin you, and turn you into... I, t I, t I, t I, t I kill you and skin you and turn you into a rug for my bedroom. There, and there he is. Yeah, what's his tongue doing? Is he like, trying to get? Is he trying to get a little taste of my toes? <laughs> he's trying. Oh, he's he's try, he's trying. Right now, I'm a bit worried, guys, because as soon as I press X, he's gonna have another bit of speech. But I don't know if he's gonna start speaking immediately or if the disc is gonna bug out on me and he's gonna stare at us again. Oh God. Uh, this is horrible. <laughs> 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 Yeah. That that laugh is famous. That's in a lot of Disney um, cartoons. That laugh. I don't. I don't understand. I don't understand. Maybe it's a PAL version thing. It's a PAL problem. That's what it is. Well done. Now go to next world. You stupid. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, so where do we go now? Oh, wait, 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 wait. We've got the bonus thing. We've got the bonus thing to do. We'll do the, we'll do the, we'll do the token collecting. Skull Rock. Which I'm pretty sure is from Peter Pan. Oh, here he is again. Oh, he's looking at us this time. Collect every crystal in the arena. And then you will get a big rub from me. Harper, thank you for 200 bits. You got jump scared by Blue Kangaroo. Yeah, I know. Tell me about it. Tell me about it. Okay. These are a little bit difficult. Um, especially with the speed characters. It's much better with a, with a turning character. Which is nice in the remake because you can choose in the middle of your game who you play as. So for these bits, I always swapped to, like, um, Pura or... Um, Polar, because they have a better turning circle. Yeah, these guys like you, the break is your best friend in these in these moments, in these parts of the game. And over, there we go. So now I just need to get the this one here around the tree that looks weirdly like a woman's leg. Ah! Fuck! Ah! 
Okay, and then we go back around again. And the wrap. There we go. I think I'm going to do it. I think. Yay! And apparently crystals make juicy sounds when you pick them up. Yay! I got a token. It's purple. Like my boil. <laughs> the, the the big boil <laughs> the big boil on my back <laughs> the big blistering and back boil my wife. thank you Braxton for gifting a sub that's so kind of you alright we're done with skull rock so let's go over to skull cock <laughs> okay right off we go off we go to gemstone valet um, and this is where all of our um our tournaments are and everything and um, which are fun and they involve racing like oh can we go what happens if i go to a spaceship you don't have the four boss keys to open this door <laughs> you don't have the four balls to get inside get them from the hospital Okay, so now we're going to to the the Papu's Temple Land. I'm pretty sure. Oh God, yep, yeah, the Lost Ruins. There we go, the Lost Ruins. Right, do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna save. Oh God's sake, Uka Uka, leave me alone. Bye. There we go. Okay, Gimbo, <laughs> let's save Gimbo. <laughs> yeah, down. I'm not even kidding. Down is reverse. That sucks. That's awful. Square is break because usually you just break and then reverse with a button. But you, but when you reverse, you got to hold down and then use the. Um, Mahu TV. Thank you for the one dollar donation. Caddy now with live study audience. No, oh, what are you doing in my study? We're going to we're, do, we're going to Cuckoo Park. We're going to the park named after Cuckoo. <laughs> <laughs> Loading. <laughs> okay, right. God, I always, I love how angry Cortex looks. And you know what? That was what. That's why. Okay. Aside from Tiny being my man on Crash Team Racing in general, the other reason I wanted to pick him is because um. He has the the best in-game model that's so different from um from what he looks like um in all the artwork and like in full body um, animations and everything. Like he looks like he looks like a really angry like pineapple with teeth. I don't think I can. Oh, you can. Okay, that's cool. I didn't I didn't I didn't know if you could um blow up missiles with um bombs. Oh, well, that's me dead. Yeah. Thanks for that. Oh, thanks for that. Bye. Ow! How dare you? I just fixed that. I started that at 20 all morning. How dare you? You can't touch me there. I've got a license. Ah! Oh, it does sound like Mary from Hell's Kitchen, yeah. Dan! You're ruining my night! Dan! <laughs> it's my night, Dan! I think you should go! You need to get out now! I'm really angry! Go! And then Dan gets kicked out and gets interviewed after. He's like, oh, I don't even like her anyway, fuck her. <laughs> and then that's it. And that's the last thing we hear of the, the feud between Dan and Mary on Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> I don't like her anyway, fuck her. <laughs> Mahu TV, thank you for one dollar. Damn it, I meant live studio audience. Because your family was laughing, I'll see myself, myself out. Oh, yeah. yeah, you fucking up was funnier than your actual joke. Well done, dude. <laughs> Good. <laughs> I'm not mean. I'm not mean. <laughs> I'm, I'm funny. 
<laughs> I'm funny, but also very angry. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Oh. Okay. Where did your backpack go? We couldn't afford to put it on. <laughs> to access this boss, oh, garage, what? You must it's poopy poopy. <laughs> yes, it is poopy poopy. Yeah, pooper pooper. Yeah. Or if you if you swap the letters around, it'd be pwap pwap. Which is my favorite anagram. Uh, ooh, pap. <laughs> oh, orp, orp. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> tiger Temple, Tiger Temple. There we go and find a lion. Mahu TV, thank you for $1. No, 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 he's got a point. My screw ups often lead to hilarity. I'll stop now. Aw. Oh, oh, don't stop. It's funny. Thank you so much. Okay. We did sing Tickabilla. There's um, there's the there's the angry pineapple. Um, t t tiny t. Uh, I was gonna call him Tiny Temper. I actually was. <laughs> oh look, it's everyone's favorite Crash character, Tiny Temper. Again, <laughs> Is that Tiny Temper? Pass out. Is that Tiny Temper? And it ends it into cussy in the car out. And then I go and get a little shot now. <laughs> Gotta go and clean up my bot bot. <laughs> Someone did a parody song of that on YouTube years ago called Ass Out, and that was that was that was pretty funny. Me and Wayne on the train. Oi oi, we go uptown. Pull our trousers down, get our ass out. <laughs> that was a good one. My favorite lyric in that song is, I live a very, very, very wild lifestyle. Like just saying very once didn't, didn't describe, it didn't, it didn't illustrate. Yeah. I guess I live a very wild lifestyle didn't really work though. I, I, I live a what? Oh, well, yeah, I bet it wouldn't fit in that line. I'm a bad boy and I live a wild lifestyle. I don't know. Is this even Tiny Templar? Am I, am I like... Uh, uh... Tiny Templar's that guy. <laughs> Tiny Tim Whistle. <laughs> what am I... Oh, my God, I accidentally used it. That's because I was trying to get a shortcut to get in that mouth over there. I can't... I can't... Wow. Tiny template. <laughs> I always liked his name because it made me think of like a really small man that had that was very angry. <laughs> I'm tiny temper. I'm a tiny man with a tiny temper. <laughs> it's your dad. <laughs> oh, poor, poor Rob. <laughs> If he just so if he happens to be watching this, sorry, but your your kids your kids think that you, you're a tiny man with a tiny temper. So I'm sorry to inform you. Right? Don't shoot the messenger. He goes red when he's cross. Oh, Ben just said tiny tempura. Hey, one chop, how you doing? Oh, fuck. Okay, now what's Crash lying there and waiting for? Because he's waiting for Dingadar to sit on him. Because it looks like it. In fact, his mouth is turning into a bit of a toilet. I think he's ready to collect. Congratulations! <laughs> Congratulations! You win a race in a racing game! How about that? To get a turbo boost, Papa. Then just ask me very politely and I'll give it to you. Oh look, we're in Port's Pyramid. Let's go. Good. <laughs> this is where having a face cam would, would ruin everything. I think the fact that you guys can't see and you can only hear is it makes it way more magical. 
Oh, there's there's Tiny the angry pineapple with his giant teeth. CTR baby says Pandras with a eight month resub. Thank you so much. Ah, let's go. Right, this this bit sucks. Can I get around? Oh, I can, but I've scraped the side of the wall a little bit. Okay. Oh, well, I kind of scraped the wall, but it's okay. I'm pretty sure you can't make this without a boost. Oh, you can just about. Just about. It's way e Okay, on Nitro Fueled, that jump is like 10 times easier to make. You won't be able to make that jump. No way. Unless you had an actual boost, I don't think you can make that jump. Yeah, you could. I think you could, in general, Nitro Fueled is just faster. Okay, there we go. Oh, damn it. That's the only thing that sucks about climbing this pyramid, is that once you, once you lose momentum, you kind of can't get it back. Oh, shit. No, I'm not going to make that. I'm not going fast enough. You have to be, like, on the third boost in order to get over. Oh, see? You, you can't make it. You're like, it's so... It's much harder. To, I mean, you can. It's just harder to do it in this version. All right. Hopefully, I can... Oh, perfect. Perfect hairpin there. Perfect. I need to get some more... um, Yeah, some more droppy items. There we go. Uh... Ah. Oh, god damn it. I've lost it. I've lost it. Yeah, that, that screwed up everything there. That wasn't very nice. Can I do it? Ah, perfect. Okay. Okay, the, the boosting system does work where the higher you jump, the bigger boost you get when you land, but it's not as pronounced or as noticeable as it is in the remake. It's been a while since I've played this. And the remake, actually, now that I think about it. Yay! I haven't had a loss yet. I'm I'm quite amazed, honestly. Because this is this is a bit harder to control than the remake is, so I'm kind of I'm kind of amazed. <laughs> Are you alright, honey? Oh, you're gonna be sick. <laughs> it's close to being sick. <laughs> Wait, what now? What are you laughing at? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he is. And I think Polar's dead. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. Fuck the stream up there. Sorry, everybody. For some reason, I have a setting on my stream where I can do this with the video. I don't know why. <laughs> but there we go. In case... No, I've got a face cam button here. I don't... I, I... Well, not... not. If I press it, then, then nothing happens. Because I haven't got a face cam equipped. <laughs> Are you fed up with me yet? Okay. Alright, now where? Dingo Canyon. This is where I live, so I should win just by being there. What do you think? I should just turn up and go, oh, I'm ace is my ass, and then everyone should leave. So. Yeah, I think so. In fact, why don't we just get our backpack out and just torch everybody? Okay, now, Engine's character model is actually the ugliest, now that I look at it. I mean, he's already weirdly shaped, but here, they, they've stuck his jaw out so far, he looks like a Picasso painting. Okay, right. Oh, the dingo, yeah, the, the, the armadillo things are still here. Oh, hello, Cash. Where did you come from? Came up from right from behind. Whee! Oh, I tried. Oh, oh, oh gosh, did I try. Well, well done, Crash. Crash just threw a bomb into the wall. Wow, I think you meant to say girl power. Isn't that a bit sexist, Coco? Women exist too, you know. Oh, great. I can use my mask. Boogity boogity. Let's go. I should be wearing a mask. Yeah. Oh, I didn't hit anybody. I, sh I need to remember to look back. That is a mechanic. Oh, well, it's a mechanic, but I'm not very good at it, so... Oh, you! You! 
YouTube is where I'll upload this stream. Bye, Polar. <laughs> Crash go. Oh my god, I did say bye, Polar. You're right. No, I meant to say goodbye, Polar. The character, not bipolar disorder. That's not what I meant at all. That's going to be taken out of context. <laughs> I don't know how it can be taken out of context. What? Jim Canick says bipolar on a stream. But that's it. <laughs> yeah, I have said a lot worse. Just the word bipolar is not one of them. Oh, God. Oh, my God. That was close. On the final lap, that would have been embarrassing. Ah. Oh, there we go. Good. This is going really well. I feel as though something something is due to go wrong. If they made a sequel to Crash Bash called Crash Rash, would you play it? Yeah. <laughs> Only if you play on Crash's Rash. <laughs> and the ob the object the object of the game is to get him all cleaned up and disinfected. That's the only reason I'd play it. Where did he get it from? Is it herpes? Yeah. I don't like these silent con congratulations screens. There is music. There, there it is. Yeah, it's just because it's just because the disc is a bit old. There you go. That's how you can tell I'm not emulating. Wapu much tired of watching puny slugs race so slow. Oh fucking hell! Want in action to lay boom, boom down, down big. big. I remember that bit Wapu because it's very racist. Best driver. Papu moves so fast. You much drags. Oh, Papu, Papu. We never learned. Oh yeah, did you guys? Okay, just then. Did uh, okay. When we get to the next boss level, I'll, I'll make I'll make a point to it before we um before we um go into the boss room door. But there's something quite funny about boss rooms. Well, I think it's quite funny anyway. There he is. <laughs> did anybody order a bin bag on wheels? <laughs> yep, he is. This guy, this guy, this guy is pretty difficult. This guy is pretty difficult, which is funny because in every other game he's in, he's he's really not that hard. He's always he's always a joke character, but he's. Oh my god! No! I landed right on my noggin. Ah! Okay, luckily, unlike Ripperoo. He throws them out but he throws them out into the sky backwards. So unlike Ripperoo where he drops the TNT immediately behind him, which means that any missile going towards them just goes right into the path of where the car is. At least here there's a higher chance of hitting him because most of the time his projectiles just end up Oh Jesus. Yeah, most of the time his his projectiles just end up going like completely over the over the thing that I fire at him. Which is useful. No! I don't know if he said something or not. Oh, God. All right, Dr. Hibbert. Okay. Okay, this is one that I thought I'd have to do more than once, but the fact that we've got this far is um a testament to my skill. Oh no, I thought I could fire them back! No! It's over! Oh my god, I clipped that! I should not have made that jump. I should not have made that jump. No way in hell. Ah, oh, look at that. Beautifully done. Oh god, I got my heart racing a bit there. Good. Oh. Oh, Hewlett fan, thank you for 200 bits. Oh, and Harper Onions, thank you for 200 bits. While I'm glad they added Tauna and Nitro Squad to uh, um, Nitro Field, I will miss the Breets. Oh, I know. Everybody misses the Breets. Um, Hewlett fan, thank you for 200 bits. Happy Crash Month, Caddy. Have some bits to celebrate. Quick um, quick question. Did you ever continue to play the remake of this after Action Vision screwed everyone over? Well, yes and no, because I stopped doing the, um, 
the Grand Prix. I, I, I got I did them to unlock the new tracks and the new characters if I could, but I stopped doing them because I realized at that point that they just wanted you to grind to unlock all the new stuff and that I wasn't happy with that. It was either pay money or grind and neither one is fun. So no, but the game itself, the base game is still fantastic. Yeah, Papu Papu, you, you, you need to lose a bit. I, I, I think he's, yeah. Where my dick gone? Me can't see dick. Me don't know what down there. There he is again. <laughs> Was that him or his stomach? I do like the jiggle physics. Before dead or alive. Here is key to help. Oxide much bigger problem for you. Him not as big, but him much more grumpy. I thought he said Hitler's not big. Him not as big. All right. And by the way, I wasn't doing a racist thing just then. I was doing an impression of the character that just so happens to be a little bit racist. I'm imitating him. I'm not making any kind of commentary. And Mahu TV, thank you for $1. Checking in on the one hour mark. Jeez, it's been an hour already. Hello from Ireland. Great to be here. Haven't caught a stream since last Banuka month. Sorry, I'll read you all the thing in a second. We've got some crystals to grab, and I missed one. Thanks. That's your fault. Definitely not my fault there. That was entirely up to you. Oh, shit. Oh, God, I've messed everything up here. Yeah, this is where we have to get, like... Jeez. God, this is fin finickety. Okay, right. Let's go in between. Ah, oh, of course. Um, okay, yeah. This is this isn't going very well. This this run is is doomed. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, I think wait a sec. Wait a sec. Ah. Uh, Oh, I need you hit the mic. Oh, God. Yeah, I ain't doing this. I think I fucked up. I think this is my first failure. Yeah, I gotta get four. There, this, this is not happening. This is not happening. Yeah, no, no way. No way. I thought it was, I thought it was going all right, but nah. Yeah! Yeah, I'm with you there, Dingadal. That sucked. There's my go, there's my first death. Sorry, anyway. I love this game, had it as a kid. Um, anyway, if I don't see you before it, happy birthday. Ah, oh, thank you. I mean, it's not for another 19 days, but thank you. Um, it's exam month, so I'll be a bit wrapped up. Ah, oh, well, good luck on that. Right, retry. Let's do this again. Right, let's get this right this time. Collect. Collect. They call me the collector. There we go. Oh, uh -huh. Yep, that's fine, that's fine. Then we just get this one over here. Where's the others? I think there's one here. There we go. Right, one there. One there. Mm. One there. Yeah, I think this one's a bit safer. This one always screws over, screws me over. I, I don't like I don't like this map. Ah! Oh, there was the other one. Ah, that was the, one of the ones I was missing. Okay, so now I just need to go up here. Yeah, it, 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 it's not because I don't like it. It's because every time I start it from a fresh mind, I forget the layout and I forget where where the best kind of routes to go are to optimize time and it always messes me up always right so there's one down here and then <gasps> no oh i missed it oh that's embarrassing can i get it in 10 seconds oh my god i'm not gonna get it 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 three two one oh my god oh dear Ah, I've got, I've got a nice purpley boil token again. That's great. 
Swabiversally, says Mech Griff with 10 month resub. Oh, I see. No, I don't. What are you talking about? Swab Swabiversally? Did you did you mean to put subversary? Because it's an anniversary of you subbing. Yeah. A swab a swab a swabiversally sounds something that's a bit invasive. You've got two keys for the door. Welcome to the door. Nothing in the door. Oh. Glacier Park. Ah, uh, I forgot that the music changes depending on the area. That's cute. Ding, do, do, do. Oh, wait, no. No, don't worry. I just, I realized something that I thought I didn't do, but I actually did do it, so it's fine. I need to remember to save as well, just in case the game breaks. Oh, the next boss door. We have to wait for the next boss door. Oh, no music. Okay. Oh, there it is. Ah. So if I'm right in thinking, this is where the AI starts getting a little bit more aggressive. God, if you guys, okay, if you guys thought that getting the um, getting the shortcut here was difficult in um, um, in Nitro Fuel, that shortcut there. It is close to impossible here. That there was luck. I just so happened to grab a shield as I was being attacked. Um, okay, I'm going to save that Aku Aku for the shortcut, actually. Yeah, because you're, you're, like, you're not going as fast. The controls are a little bit looser, which means that the ice physics are even slipperier. Okay, let's do it. Oh, that, okay, no, actually, maybe it's easier. But then I have got an Aku Aku mask. Yeah, maybe, okay, maybe that was the mask, but maybe the distance is shorter to compensate for the lack of boost. Maybe they made it wider in the remake, which makes sense. Because if everybody could do that shortcut, then nobody would win these races. It would be too easy. I like how it's a shortcut that not everybody likes taking because it's so, so risk and reward. But if it's a little bit easier here... Yeah, I think it is. I think it's just easier in general. I suppose if you're going to get more boosts and everything in the remake and you're going to go faster, then they have to make the distance wider, otherwise it will be too easy. And then everyone will be doing it. I do love it. I did love it in online matches of that, um, of um, Nitro Fueled, whenever Blizzard Bluff came on. And you'd see even the people that came first, usually the people that came first still didn't use that shortcut or if they did they got away with using it once but the thing is is that it's so difficult to get that if you mess it up um you, you your your penalty for being thrown back in the race is so high it's just not worth it so i've never seen anybody in an online race take that shortcut more than twice in a three lap race i've never seen someone do it three times in a row oh okay we could turn the wheel but we couldn't go forward that was fun ah right Thank you, Caboose15, for 200 bits. Give me a second. Um, if Crash did ever find his way to Smash Bros and you could pick a Crash-themed stage, would you rather see Ensanity Island or Cortex Castle? Ensanity Island. There's There needs to be more tropical kind of locations. And they can put the Wampa Fruit in there and they can put the boxes because that f fits in with the theme, you know, the wooden crates and the tropical colours and everything. There's a lot of there's a lot of stages already kind of like gothic-y, castle-y. Or maybe they could do it like... Um, when you're when you're on like Cortex's blimp or something from Crash One, and um, oh Jesus, yeah they could yeah they could they could design it around like Cortex's blimp, and the blimp goes to different areas, kind of like the F Zero stage, um, or the um, is it the Kirby's Dream Ride stage? I can't think, but there's loads of stages in Smash where you see multiple environments in one go. I hate that I hate that turn so much. Okay, there we go. Right, someone's going to take that. Cortex did. That's good. There we go. Whee! Oh, God, I slowed down. That's bad. I'm not looking forward to Komodo Joe's boss race, to be perfectly honest. It's going to be quite difficult. This track is not... The, not... Uh, not 
It's just that turning. It's just that turning. Can't stand it. There is a there is a bit of an exploit you can do with the whole in midair break jump thing. I mean, it's not it's not breaking the game or exploiting anything. It's just a little trick you can do. But you can do tight turns in midair after a jump by breaking in midair, and it requires like I don't know like three button presses in quick succession. So it's it's not the easiest thing to do. But it's the best way to quickly climb up that turn there. Because you can't drift turn unless you've got the best turn character, which I don't. I have the worst turn character. Or if you break, which slows you right down. So... Oh, jeez. It's still slow, though. Oh, God. Am I going to make it? Oh, no! I'm flat! I'm pancaked. Oh, that's not bad. Ah, oh, there we go. Woo. Good. Oh, Ma okay. Marmike in the chat has just given some interesting information. I don't know if you noticed, and if this is a PAL issue. Oh, do tell. If you go to the Aku Aku Uka Uka hints and click on one of the messages, they, you, um, you notice that they use the model of the masks they use when you activate them in a race. Oh wow, so it's like the flat sprites? Uka Uka's model is horrifying. Oh dude, we've got to have a look. Yeah, I'm disappointed with you too, Tiny. Why do they think you call- why, why do you think you're called Tiny? You should be ashamed of yourself. Yeah, I'm going to look at this, um, this hints mask thing. That sounds like a universal thing. I, I can't imagine that being a PAL exclusive problem, but let's have a look. Uka Uka hints. Oh! Um. Oh! Um, to access a racetrack, drive that's onto a warp pad that's that awful. That has an active warp vortex, and it will take you to the track start line. Finish a track in first um, place to win a trophy. As you collect more trophies, is that Uka Uka or a beach ball with teeth? Good luck. That's hideous. That's hideous. I hate that. That's awful. Thank you. Thank you. No, not thank you. Screw you for telling me about that. I did not need to ever see that. All right. Oh, I should probably save soon. I need to remember to save. I need to remember to save. Harper, thank you for 200 bits. Last donation reminding you to save the game. Oh, yeah. Well, I just said that as you donated. Thank you so much. Can someone get me some water, please? No. Oh. Alright, no house for you then. I'll just live on the street for all I care. I do love um Polar's little toe beans that he gets out when he's driving his car. He doesn't hold the wheel. He just he just has flat toe beans against the steering wheel. Oh you bastard, you stole it. I was just being nice about you and then you took it from me. You ruin everything. Oh god! That was a bad sequence of events there. That was a bad turn. That was quite lucky. I nearly got hit by the seal there, but I managed to scrape by. Yeah, just got to do a lot of hops and a lot of um, mid-air brake turns to get around that corner without falling off into the ocean. Right. Not me. Yeah, I was going to say second place would have got hit. Thanks, Ames. Can I make it? Oh, just about. I think in this game, because you move a little bit slower in general, I think the only people that are, can safely get away with doing shortcuts like that without an actual speed boost to help them over, I think they're the only people that can do that, high speed characters. Which makes sense because they've got really, really awful turning and not very good acceleration, so there has to be a payoff somewhere. There we go. So yeah, it only makes sense that if you manage to pull off a perfect little um Oh that was close. A perfect little sequence of um drift boosts and get to, to get to the level three boost. It makes sense that the top speed character should just be able to get over some of these shortcuts without any extra assistance from a Aku Aku mask or something. Oh, see, I just made that, and that was with one boost. That's risky. That's really risky. But I don't think anybody else would be able to do that without a boost or an Aku Aku mask. Oh, oh, oh sorry, Annie, what are you going to say? Oh, no, I was just, just going to say, oh, I think as well, with that shortcut back in um, Papu Papu's temple, 
uh, or Papu's Pyramid, um, rather. With the one where you have to, when you can hop over the top of that um, that other pyramid and skip that big hairpin turn. Um, but you have to hop over a gap to make it. I think that one would be impossible without a boost if you're anyone other than um, Tiny or Dingadal in the original game. But yeah, say again, honey. Yeah. 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 There's tiny PlayStation symbols on the screws of the PS5. That wouldn't, I wouldn't, that wouldn't surprise me because they've got tiny, like the grips on the controllers are tiny little. That, uh, if it's not true, that's believable. It sounds like it could be true because, oh no. Oh, I'm so far ahead anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, hello everybody, I'm Cat Icarus and this is my cocky hat. Um, yeah. No, I, I, that sounds like it could be true because the, the controller, the controller, have you looked at the controller grips? Yeah, the controller grips are like embedded with tiny little PlayStation symbols. Oh, that looks real. Yeah, that, 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 I believe that. Oof. One Chop just said he had to, Ben just said he had to catch a mouse. Did he miss anything? What, for your dinner? Caught a mouse for what? To eat or to kill? Oh no, it's not. No, the, the screwdriver holes aren't PlayStation shaped. There's just little engravings on the screws. You don't need like an X circle square and triangle screwdriver to get in. Although that wouldn't be the most ridiculous thing to say either because Nintendo products, most if not all Nintendo products need specific Nintendo screwdrivers to get in, which is bullshit. And what usually happens is that I'll have a pack of screwdrivers, and um, I won't save just yet. Um, uh, yeah, I'll have a pack of screwdrivers for Nintendo console maintenance, getting into the 3DS, getting into the Switch Joy-Cons and everything to customize them and sort out the buttons and everything when they break. Um, but then I'll forget what those screwdrivers are for, and I'll have like this little pack in my office, and I'm like, what the hell are these shapes? What are they for? What, what did I ever use these for? And then I throw them away. Because I never use them. I only use them like once a year. And then I remember, oh shit, they're the Nintendo screwdrivers. And then I have to go and get them again. Oh, all right, Cortex. Right, now this one's fun in the... This one's extra fun in the remake because of the amount of boost you can get. Thank you for the host, whoever that was. I can't see right now. Um, Knockout Wolf, does that say? Thank you so much. God. Look away from the screen for five seconds, and I, I'm, I'm lost where I was going. I mean, yeah, this this level's fun on this on the on this version of the game as well, but it's extra fun on Nitro Fueled just because of how much boost you can stack and how much you can accumulate, and like the blue flame boosts and everything. You can go so quickly and just keep it going on the remake, whereas this one you kind of only have at most like two seconds extra boost that gets stacked. Still fun though, and if you can and if you can find another place to jump off from within the two seconds that you're boosting on the floor, then the boost just keeps going. It's just not anywhere near as cathartic or fast or satisfying as it is on the remake, I suppose. Right, I'm going to use this now. No! Oh, this might. Might be a loss, guys. Might, might be, might be eating my words. I might be losing this one. Do you know what the boss race would suck in this level? Like, imagine you're in a boss race and the boss is just shitting potions and like farting TNTs in your face, and you can't even see where they've been placed because of the ridges in the map. So you have no idea where you're where you're gonna land. That would suck. I mean, luckily the, the stage is nice and wide, so at least you've got like a, high, a higher chance of missing them, but still. Oh god, 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 god! Mm. Oh god, he's right behind me. There we go. Whoever gets that speed boost is having a nice bit of green, courtesy of me. Oh, I'm not outrunning it. Ah, stingy dog. Thank you for the sub. Oh, stinky dog. Is it stingy or stinky? I, I, I missed that. Oh, God. 
makes me wonder if anybody ever played this game without using the drift mechanic because and then realized that it made the game 10 times easier because I don't think any of these races would be possible to win without using the drift. Unless you got like ridiculously lucky. I just can't imagine it. Oh, actually, do you know what? Now that I say that, I think you can... St okay, I don't think the boost itself can be more powerful and be made faster, but I think you can actually stack how long the, the boost lasts based on how many ramp jumps you make and how high you've jumped and, you know, accumulative links and stuff. Because the boost itself doesn't feel any faster, but I feel as though I'm staying on the floor in boost mode a bit longer than I would be in any other level. So maybe that's how it works. Maybe you don't actually boost any faster, but you the boost lasts a bit longer. It's hard to say. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, okay, nobody is getting on that speed boost without getting a nice dollop. That's not happening. Ah. Oh. oh god. I sc yeah, I scrimmed. I scrimmed. I scrimmed to the end. I scrimmed to the end with my lovely whim. Ah. I think I just did it. Yeah, I'm fine. Yay. Good. Haven't lost anything yet. Harpus, 200 bits. I never used the drift boost in Nitro Fuel. Okay, well, first of all, I feel sorry for you because it makes the whole game... A, it makes the game so much more fun, and B, that's what makes it stand out against all the other kart racers, even if you don't like Crash Bandicoot. So I feel sorry for you for not using it. But also, I can't imagine winning any races on uh, even normal difficulty without using the boost. Were you on easy? I'm not judging, I'm just wondering. Because there's no difficulty options on this one. You don't need to drift. Yeah, on Mario Kart, you can get away with not drifting. Because that's what you do all the time, honey. But, like... Oh, yeah. Engine's losing animation's weird. He just... He just, has a, he just has a fit and then steams off. Yeah. He, tur he turns into a bathtub. He turns into, he turns into a bathtub with a kettle top. He looks like what, honey? Oh, the jacuzzi jet bass, you're right. Oh, here he is. Are you going to say something? Why is it that you and Ripperoo aren't speaking? Hello? Hello? So, <laughs> Shit, I missed my cue. Tracks. Well, now That's Komodo see, Joe. I am the most most forgettable characters. I, I don't like. I, I, I'm not big on the Komodo brothers, to be honest. Their boss, le their boss level sucks in Crash 2. It's not the best fight in Crash Bash, and they haven't got the the awkward charm of um, Papu Papu, and the fact that Papu Papu is so terrible that he's a basically a meme. There's just nothing about the Komodo brothers that do much to me. Do much for me, rather. Okay, they don't do. They don't do anything to me. I can look after myself. A gun, thank you for the subscription. Or is it a gun? I don't know. Um, oh yeah, no, the, he, he's actually pretty cool in the remake. I'll give, I'll give you that. His his intro in the remake is awesome when he sharpens his sword on the t car's tires. Yeah, I, I like him in the in uh, Nitro Fueled, but in general, I'm not big on the. I like their designs, but I'm just not big on them as characters. Um, anyway, this is what I was going to say for the boss door. So when you go into the boss room. It's a big, it's a, it looks like an endless void, right? So you drive in and the idea is that you keep on driving and driving and driving until you reach the boss room. Except that's not how the game is built. Basically, you drive in and then a trigger happens to make the boss start. So if you drive fast enough in, you'll actually hit the back wall of the boss room. So you, you get teleported. It, it's trying to make you think you'll keep, you keep driving forward through a tunnel, but instead you just hit a wall. Yeah, there it was. Little ah, just ran into the wall. Oh shit! Yeah, I did forget to save, didn't I? Okay, I'll save after this boss. I love his teeth. His teeth look like paper cutouts. Okay, now this guy is pretty damn difficult, if I remember correctly, and he's on a horrible course as well. Well, not a not a bad course, just an awkward course. I don't even remember what he throws. Is it nitro? I 
Okay, I'm just gonna I'm gonna play it safe. Oh my god. There we go. Okay, he'll have to hit that. No, he won't hit that. Did you just call me a fucker? Fucker. <laughs> okay, I think by putting um droppable items on the um speed pads, I think I'm conditioning the AI to not use the speed pads. Because he's quite, he's surprisingly far back for a boss racer. So if I just keep my drop back items. Oh god! There we go. He might just go around them. He'll either go around them and miss the speed boost, or he'll get hit by the by the um the item. So it's a lose lose basically. Oh, he's right there. Oh god, he could get me on the last lap. Oh, this would sh Oh, this- I'm shitting. Okay, let's go. I haven't got any Wumpa Fruit either, so I'm not going as fast as I possibly could either. Oh wait, he went- What happened? Did he hit my- did he hit my potion? He's really far back. What's going on? Oh! Oh, this is stressful. I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, he got hit by the TNT. I heard that. Oh, he's like way behind. Oh, he's not getting anywhere near me. Yeah. All right. I thought I was going to lose there. It's okay. 35, 35, 35. 35 seconds on every lap. That is not every day you see stats like that. Jesus. Good. We did good, guys. Placeholder, thank you for $8.31 uh, donation. Hey, Caddy, long-time fan. If your life was turned into a kart racing game, what would your best and worst stats be? <gasps> That's a really good question. Um. Oh, let's do all of us. Let's do all of us. Um. What would our best stats be in a kart race if we were all kart racer characters? I think, honey, you'd be high turning because you don't you you don't rely on drifts, um, but you also walk quite slowly. So I think that you'd be not the highest with the speed, but you're you're very flexible and yeah. So yeah, I was gonna say so flexibility goes with handling. So if you're talking about handling, acceleration, and speed, I think your acceleration would be pretty high, your speed would be kind of low, and your turning would be really good. Um, Amy's speed and acceleration would be both top, but the turning would be like You're trash. So slow after all. Surprise. Why so serious? Here's a key for the win. Yeah, Phoebe's Phoebe's acceleration would be terrible. Speed would be all right because once you get going, you're all right. And turning would be yeah, yeah you, you've got a head screwed on. I think it would be all right. You'd be average speed, average turning, low um low acceleration. You, honey, you'd be high turning. Low speed, middling acceleration. If we were all kart racer characters, Amy would be high speed, high acceleration, but just can't even turn left or right without crashing. What would I... Okay, I'm going to let you guys decide. What would I be? No, no, I don't... No, I don't want you to say that. I want you to tell me based on what you know the worst... So I'm worst acceleration, worst turning, and worst... Oh, thanks. <laughs> The good ones. <sighs> okay. Oh, this is the one with the nitro crates. Yeah, the canyon level. I forget about this one. Right. So th how I usually get around this is by... Uh, yeah, I go around I go around the outskirts first. And then um, we head for the middle. Oh, Stanley, was that you? Oh, my God. That is... That's toxic. Oh, my God. Oh, I missed it. I missed it. How did I miss it? Yeah, he definitely did. Oh, that is awful. That's like dead mouse smell. Oh, Ben, ben did you did you send the dead mouse over to Stan? Did you have like a little exchange in the alleyway? <laughs> the idea of Stan being like a back alley drug dealer with his coat on. <laughs> There's something very funny about that. So have you got the stuff? <laughs> oh shit, it's the cops! <laughs> yeah, and then and then the cops would get there and he'd be like... <laughs> oh no, I'm not gonna make it! Oh, I'm not gonna make it! 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 I didn't make it. 
Have I smelt dead mouse before? Yes, I have a pet snake. Oh, wow. That's, that's... Uh. oh shit! I can't even have a. I can't even have a drink of water. See, <laughs> Crash Team Racing, the game where you're not allowed to hydrate. Okay, right. I think a lot of that time was wasted by me trying to grab um. Oh fuck! Okay, well, I've now wasted even more time. So this is this is good, going really well. Okay, I'm gonna go down. Okay, there we go, right. So then I'll go up here. And I'll go... Ali oh shit! Okay. So I missed... To get that one. And then we get this one. And then we'll head for the lower levels. Oh, bollocks. Ah! No! There we go. Bloody hitboxes! Oh, these are the ones I already got earlier. Oh, that's bad. Oh, this is really bad timing. Ah! Okay, alright. I think in the remake, they actually put the nitro crates closer together, so you have to use the... the rolly balls more often. I'm pretty sure, anyway. Okay, I'm not, I'm not doing this one either. No way. Where's the last one? Where is it? <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> and just as I said you didn't need to use the bowling balls, just as I said that. DJ! 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 That calls for a DJ. Calls for a celebration. Dictionary. Come on. Excellent! Unbelievable. And I got another boil. I think I think I deserve that boil. What do you think? Yeah. I just realised we've gone we're we're three quarters of the way through the main story, and I've been playing for an hour and a half. So... You forget how you forget how short older games are. It's just because you're a kid and you spend ages on them and trying to like get better at them and stuff. Right, save the game, save the goddamn game. What's that? Oh, that's another race. Oh, it's over there. It's over there. Right. Nice detail as well how all the um the podiums are there so that you know it's an actual location that you can drive to. There we go. Let's save Gimpo. What's up, honey? Oh, is he farted? Yeah, we told you. Oh, it's a fresh one. Well, thank God he's our send your way. Right through the big bit through the door. You've got three keys. Open the door. Go in the door. Have a nice day. City, city. That's where we are. We're in the city, little city. No. Okay, now this map always confuses me because I never know. Yeah, because there's two racetracks there, but one's low and one's high, and I always get confused. Ah. Yep. Ah. Ah. There we go. Cortex Castle. Oh, this is a great track. I love this track. These are some, There are some great tracks here. Really good tracks here. Yeah, you're right. I do like... Um, Hot Air Skyway is great as well. It's dangerous, but it's good. I'm pretty sure that's this game's version of Rainbow Road. Right, let's do this. We've got a trophy race. Right, here we go. That's how we do it in my garden. Ah, oh, the rain. Oh, I love this. I love PS1 graphics so much. Like, I love how, like, this generation have... They all have distinctive looks about them. In fact, no. That's unfair. Most, most of the generations up until, I'd say, PS3, Xbox 360, had their own distinctive look. And um, I, I love the... 3D models that are all jaggedy and pixelated and like they're very clearly um, very clearly um, low polygonal models I love that look I think I think it should be classed as a, as a, a retro aesthetic as much as like 8 bit 16 bit but yeah I much prefer this over like um, Nintendo 64's um, rounded shapes which I do I do love that don't get me wrong but I, I, I just I just love how like PS2 models looked all kind of... They were trying to be real, but they were kind of uncanny valley, so they all looked like mannequins. Um, so I like that look. And then I like the PS1 when it looked like this. I like the Nintendo 64 when it had, like, all the 
smooth, like, the smooth gyrating um, 3D models that are all just really simple shapes that are, like, really smoothly glued to each other. And, um, yeah, 16-bit, 8-bit, 4-bit, 2-bit, 1-bit. Ah, okay, I'm not going to make this shortcut. No way. I could try. No! Yeah, that was probably the best thing to do. Probably uh, not not the best outcome, but that was probably the safest thing for me to do. Oh, no! Oh, disaster on the track. Disaster! Um, I can't really do a death noise in the middle of the race, but I'll take that into account. Thank you, Amy. Ah! Whee! Okay, I'm, I'm going this way apparently. I, I didn't really think about it, but there we go. Right, go. I probably should have saved this for the shortcut now that I think about it. Ah! Okay, you can't. Okay, in, in the remake, the um, breaking in midair turn trick works way better. I think it's actually a glitch in the in that one. Or it's intentional because of how much faster you go. I can, I'm not really sure. Take that. Oh, that was a risk and it paid off! Yes, baby! Yeah! Wow. Oh, I should not have made that. Oh, okay, there's my punishment. That's that's fine. That's fair. That's, that's fair enough. I should not have made that jump. There are two jumps in this playthrough so far I should not have made. One on, one on Papu's Pyramid and one just there. Good. Oh, Christ. Oh, yeah, that is an AVGN reference. I totally forgot. Becky West, thank you for the sub. Um, Yesu Yo, thank you for the resub for seven months. That's so kind of you. KP Wills, thank you for 300 bits. Bits for the Bandicoot. This was the first game I ever played after Crash 3. Got beat by my older sister many, many times. Oh, that's a shame. Did you go to hospital about it? Come on, skip, skip, skip. I want to get on with it. There we go. Congratulations. You win a trophy. You win a rope. Wait, well, is that Engine Labs down there that we have to go to next? I love how most of the levels in this world are all just like right, right angle turns and just really difficult shit. Okay. See, this is where I get... Yeah, the map confuses me. So I think we go down here, I think. Yeah, yeah, there's the castle. Oh. Ah, there we go, engine labs, here we are. The scientific term is air braking. The reason why it works better in Nitro Fueled is because in the, o in the OG, braking always cuts your reserves, and that means your boost, while in Nitro Fueled, you're fine as long as you're in midair. Yeah, I know, it, it does feel different, like I said. It's not sloppier, it's looser in this version. As you can see, I'm having absolutely no problems playing the game. I, I haven't lost a single race yet. I think it's only going to get a little bit frustrating when we go for the relics, to be honest. There we go. Yeah, this one's, this one's a very boost-heavy level as well. Oh, you can't even add to the boost there? I just drift boosted there and I didn't go any faster. Yeah, so that just proves it. You can't make the boost itself faster, but you can make it last longer. That's just proved it right then and there. You can stack the length of the boost, but you can't make the boost any more powerful. Oh, I clipped the edge! Damn it all. Oh, well, I'm fucked now. This is it. So long, everybody. Nice knowing you. Boom. Oh, at least I didn't go down the hole. That would that would, that would have been embarrassing. Oh, what's up, Stan? You all right, Poop? You okay? What's up? Are you upset? Are you upsetting him, baby? Oh, awesome. Got an orb. Got the magical blue shell orb. 
Oh, Tiny was in front? Dude, how could you do this to me? After everything we've been together through in Vietnam. Oh, damn you. Oh, God almighty, this is getting close. Okay, I'm gonna take a risk here. No, I'm not. I'm not taking that risk. Oh, I would have been crushed. That was good call. Good call. Too risky. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Oh, come on. Come on. No, are you kidding me? That's how we do it in are the you, garden. Are you kidding team racing me? I might actually lose this race. I might actually not win. How did you knock that off immediately? Computer player blatantly just cheated there. Crash ran into a TNT, did one jump, and the TNT came off. That's not fair. I saw that. You tried to hide it off screen, but I got onto screen just before you could hide that. What a load of shit. Okay, second place has been attacked by a nitro box. That's fine with me. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I can get away with that. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Uh... You know what? I, get, I, get, I don't give this game shit um, for its visuals, but I, I do like to mention how they, like, obviously the game doesn't look as good on, as, on the PS1 as the actual Crash trilogy does because there's a lot more going on and it needs to be faster and it needs to run smoother. But I've always looked at that as a kind of stylistic thing and you know I've, I've always been a bit like oh yeah it, it like it does sacrifice a bit of graphical fidelity to make it run smoother but it actually still looks really damn good for a ps1 kart racer with a lot of detail going on like there is a lot going on here and it's moving really fast so yeah i don't know why i've ever knocked the game for going a little bit lower on the graphics honestly i don't know i don't know what i was talking about did that does that say chick urine Chick urine, thank you for the sub. Okay. Oh dear. Oh. Night oh, night, Phoebe. Ah. Oh. Yep, still, still frightening. The Ooh. the lack of any music on these bits is still frightening. My poor, my poor old PlayStation disc. Ooh. I mean, if you don't look after these things, you get punished for it, right? It lets you know. Chica Rin, thank you. Not Chick Urine. Sorry. I read a, I read a name as Chick Urine and it's Chica Rin. <laughs> oh, lads. Oh, come on, blokes. Let's go. Come on, blokes. Let's go. Let's go to Hot Air Skyway. Yes, it's the best... It's the best bit of Winnie the first Winnie the Pooh movie. It is the best bit when Tigger loses Rabbit and and Pooh in the forest, and he goes, "Hey, you bloke!" <laughs> he just he's he's an he's an American he's an American c comedy voice actor doing a British thing, and it is the funniest thing. It doesn't fit. Nothing similar to that has ever been said in any Disney movie before or after that. Oh, was Rue? But it was Rue there as well. Oh, that's Rue's a guy. Kanga's a mum. But... No, because they were in the forest. He was standing on top of the log and he lost them. Kanga was at home. She never does anything exciting. She just goes, Well, be careful, dear. And then and then they get lost and nearly die. <laughs> and then she, and then the next day she goes, Now go, be careful, dear. She never learned, learns her lesson. Where's Daddy Kanga? <laughs> Watch for traffic, dear. Watch out for the deforestation machinery, dear. No sword blades can give you quite a slice! Oh, God almighty. Go, go, go. There we go. I forgot how ploppy this song sounded. Yeah, it's a very ploppy song. Oh, God, I braked at the wrong time there. I broke. I braked? I broke? Yeah, on the remake, it's it's got it's the same song on the remake, but it's just a little bit more like upbeat with the drums and the percussion and everything. Like it, it feels more intense, but here it's just a little bit. It's just like clown music. Yeah, it's not it's not as intense as it is on the um 
on the remake. That's funny. Oh my! That would have been such good timing if I hadn't slid off the end there. I'm still first though. Miraculously, I'm still first. Okay, Polar, you should not be going faster than me. You're the lowest speed character in the game. I'm calling bullshit. There you go. Take that. Smelly old... Smelly old rag. Ah, gotcha. Oh my god. Yeah, you should not be getting in front of me. You should not be getting in front of me, dude. Not how, not how it works. All right, you listen here, right? You listen here. There we go. Yay! I can never get that turning right. I can never drift around it, which is annoying because it's the final turn. So, like, even if you're first, everything can go wrong at that one point. There we go. No! You kidding me? Ah, oh, well, that's me fucked. I'm not making it. I'm not making this. This final lap, I'm not doing it. Oh, could I? Could I bring it back? Could I BIB? Could I bring it back? Could the cads take take the trophy? Could could cads take the trophy? When everyone said he couldn't do it. Oh, he can do it. No, 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 please, please. I'm not doing it. 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 No. Yes, I am doing it. I am. Yes. Ah. That was so fucking close. DJ, 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 DJ. Yeah. Dictionary. Come on. Excellent. That was so good. Oh, I, I thought like I thought that was over. I thought that was over. I was like, pack it up, lads. We're leaving. Blokes. Pack it up, you blokes. We're going. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Bits for that epic save. Thank you for... <laughs> that's what they're there for. I mean, it is called cheering. That's your cheering bits. You cheer when something good happens in a playthrough. So thank you. Watch an artist. Thank you for 300 bits. And Caboose15, 200 bits. Clutch win was clutch. Nicely done, good sir. What does that mean? But thank you. Ooh. Fuck right off. That was tense. Oh, that was tense. That was. Oh, you wish you had the face cam you could see, you could see the reaction. Uh, yeah, but um, imagine what I look like. You can imagine. You've got a brain, haven't you? <laughs> you can use your head. What are you, you fucking stupid? Sorry. Um, yeah, 692. I've got 692 people that are willing to watch me abuse them. Rathman, thank you for one dollar donation. Talking about soundtrack, have you listened to the pre-console mixes of the classic? Yeah, yes, on SoundCloud, absolutely. I, found, I in one of my videos, I recommended people go to his SoundCloud. He updates it all the time. I just wish that they would release it on vinyl or CD or something, you know, or on iTunes or something, because I've got the Insane Trilogy soundtrack, but it just is not the same. Oh my God. Do you know something I heard? A common, a common thing I heard when Nitro Fuel came out came out was even on on normal mode, the difficult for the difficulty. Thank you for the gifted subs. I can't see who it is, but thank you. Yeah, it's a, a common a common thread I was hearing was that Nitro Fuel was um, harder, um, even on normal mode, and I disagree because of how fast you can go in Nitro Fuel. If you're any good with boosting. You win every every single race halfway across the track, but because you can't go as fast in this game, I think this one's harder, to be honest. This, this for me, is closer to playing Nitro Fueled's Adventure Mode on the hard difficulty, and this is just the standard mode. So if anybody struggled with Nitro Fueled, I would say you'd struggle more with this one. 
I mean, obviously, I haven't lost any races yet, but I, I've been close a lot of times, and I've never been close on Nitro Fueled on normal mode because of how good the boosting is. It's not broken, it's just incredibly rewarding if you're any good at it. <laughs> it's a difficult thing to master, but once you do, you basically won every race. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I don't remember the patio. Yeah, I don't remember where we were last time with the patio saga. Oh, they wanted family photos of us going to get the patio. Yeah, I remember. Ah, oh, that was a good hit from a ball there. I like hitting people with my balls. It's a good slap. That was a sucking noise, not a slapping noise. It's quite hard to replicate that noise with your tongue. Oh my god! I'm not looking forward to Oxide, gotta be honest. I remember Oxide being quite fucking hard. Again, not much of a problem on um, Nitro Fuel, but on this I remember him being quite a bitch. So, I guess we'll see what happens. Oh my god, that's my nitro! Oh. I like how the game's just starting to drop frames now as well. Unfortunately, this... I mean, obviously, a lot of PS1 games will drop frames when there's a lot of shit going on, but it's... On this game specifically, this is where the PAL version is... It's the same... Well, it's the same with the other Crash games with um, the PAL versions, because they just... They run at a lower frame rate to coincide with our stupid 90s TVs. So instead of things, like if you had a game that ran at 30 FPS, it would run at 24 for us. Or 25. And this is another case where we're running at 25 frames a second right now, I'm pretty sure. Which is fine, I'm, I'm, I'm coping absolutely fine. But it is a smoother experience on the US version. Which works really nicely with fighting games and racing games. Wow. Uh, Oh god, I fucked up! No, you'll be fine. Just take the switch out the dock. Ah, there we go. Good. Um, that was Craig Bread. Thank you for gifting five subs. So kind of you. Thank you. Oh well, I mean, I know all about the stricter, the stricter, um, the strict, the stricter relic times from Crash Three. Because Jesus Christ, hot cocoa was a nightmare. Was it hot cocoa or was it? Oh, it's it's the it's the it's the bonus cocoa level where it's open world. It's that one. Is that hot cocoa? Pretty sure it is. Yes, I I uh, no, I'll save the game after Pinstripe. I'll I'll save the a game after Pinstripe. But yeah, like it's it's nothing game breaking. Like you, obviously, I, I I grew up with PS One, so I'm I'm obviously like I I haven't got a problem with twenty five frames per second, but. It does mean that there's more... Oh shit. Yes? Hello? What? Ah! You, you call that racing? Forget about it. I've, I had a pizza drink before I came into the, the game. Anyway, I think you're a very attractive you lady, and, and I think you, it'll be an honor if you slept with me, because I'm a very important man. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my slot mouth. Ah, pinstripes and palange. Let's go! Yeah. So yeah, it, it is. You're right. It is. It is hot cocoa. So yeah, that the 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 pal time on um on hot cocoa for platinum relic is like 11 seconds, whereas on the American version, which, which were the people that made the fucking game, it's like 33 seconds or something ridiculous. Um, and I don't know if it's if it's the same story um, on the relics for this game as well, <laughs> specifically the PS1 version. I guess we'll find out when when I come to do all the relics. Oh my God, he's right there! Okay, that's when you attack him, isn't it? <laughs> Damn you! Oh fuck's sake! Yeah, he's Watch the annoying one. Head. You just need to get in front and stay in front. There's not really much else you can do. Oh, shit off. Oh my god, I didn't even see that! 
did not even see that one. Oh, this is bad, guys. This is this is bad. Right, so I need to remember on the twirly whirly curly bit. That's where he doesn't um, fire anything. Oh Jesus! Stay to the side. Luckily, the racetrack is wide enough where it. That's completely okay. Okay, right, go. Gotcha. I'm just going to keep these missiles to myself. I just, I've got my, I got my eye on the, on the corner map, and I'm just seeing like after, after he, after you knock, um, knock him out. I think it's the same with all the bosses, but after you knock him out specifically, it's amazing how quickly he catches up to you again. Damn it! I'm out. No. I can't catch up now. Does he slow down when he gets too far ahead? I think he does. What a weird boss. Say good night. Oh. oh, somehow that worked. I don't know how, but it did. Okay, right. I don't want to look back while I'm on a turn. Got him. Say good night. No, he's gonna blow me up too! Okay. Right in the middle of the track. He's not going to get around that. Except when he gets around it. Okay. I don't think it's a mullet. It's one of those slicked back gangster hairstyles. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Okay, well, this is the deciding lap then. Not much else I can do except try and beat him. It's quite hard to link um, drift boosts into each other on this version as well, because you jump a lot lower. Gotcha. Right, come on, don't fuck up the shortcut. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Right, just drop everything I can. Just fucking keep him back, keep him back. Yeah, just drop everything. Hopefully he'll hit one of them. Yep, he hit him. Oh god, look at him accelerate off. He's so fast after he gets hit. Oh, he did hit it. Maybe he just bowled it over. Okay, if I don't fall off, I think this race is in the bag. I suppose what you got what you got to remember is that yeah, it's unfair that the boss racers can just use the same items over and over again, but if you get in front, you can spam items to drop behind you as well. So, it is kind of it's fine. Oh. Good. I remember that being the hardest bit of the fucking game when I was a kid. Jesus Christ. Not too bad. That's how we do it in my garden. Uh, Gnarly Sheen, thank you for the sub. At least it ain't Oxide. I'm not I'm not looking forward to Oxide. I remember Pinstripe being I remember Papu Papu, Pinstripe and Oxide being really difficult in the original, and we've done two of them, so I'm just hoping that the third one it goes nice on me. He might be my first loss. This might be a perfect, an absolute flawless victory, perfect adventure game playthrough of Crash Team Racing for PS1, which I've never done before. So if I do it, this it will be the first time I've ever done it, which I'll be very upset. Oh, I got no gun. He looks like a chicken from Chicken Run. <laughs> I got no bullets. I can't shoot the winner. Oh no! Oh, that's a low so, shot. You beat me fair and square. You was beat me. I thought you'd be as lucky with oxide. Here's a key for your troubles. Oh brother! I don't understand this story. So like, we n oh, <laughs> you're right. <laughs> you need to turn into Mr. Garrison. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry while I was thinking about what to say. What took you so long? I hope you like my sideways mouth. I've been practicing in the mirror all day. Yeah, he is Squidward. It did turn into Squidward. You're right. Okay, I'm going to save the game before we do this. Just in case everything goes tits up. And I better win because otherwise I'm going to be very mad.
Oh, hang up. There's a. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, we're not. We're not. We're not racing him just yet. No, 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 no. We're not racing him just yet. We are. We are gonna go back to. No, that's no, that's where that's where you get back to the beginning. No, no, no. We have to do the um, the Nitro Court. I think it's called the the the, the Castle Court collection race for the Crystal. Why does this take you? Oh, it takes you to the tournaments. Shit. Okay, right. Right, this is the way. Pretty sure. This takes you back to the castle. The Lost Ruins? Oh, fuck, I'm lost. Um, I'm totally lost. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, no, no, this is the right way to go. I think you can get back to Cortex Castle from the beginning. I think it loops around. Wait a minute. There we go. A few of you might be wondering, but Caddy, what's the point? And I'll tell you why. No, specifically, what's the point of going all the way back to an earlier level? If all you're going to do is, um... Like, because I was right outside the boss door. Why didn't I just go to the boss? Because it was right there. And that's because I want to spend more time with you guys. That's why. Is that, is that a problem? Right, so I think we go down for this one. Nope, that takes you that way. Shit. There we go. Bingo, Nitro Core. Oh, this has been a ridiculously... Like, I, I didn't realise how much people liked watching me stream these things. Like, I, I've got a really, really dedicated and awesome viewer base with um, the newer games, but it's like double for these games. Like, I've gone from like 300, 400 viewers a stream to like 700. Like, a steady, consistent 700. Usually with the new games, they, um... Yeah, people people tend to teeter off after the kind of hour mark. But I've kept like 700 plus people in somehow. I don't know what I've done, but thank you. Oh fuck! Just I'm taking I'm taking the hit and I got over. <laughs> Glitch, exploit, speed run. Uh, shit. Oh, this isn't very good, is it? Yay, I did it. Okay, right. There we go. Oh, you're kidding me. I think... I remember this one not being too hard because I think the time limit's quite generous, if I'm right in remembering. I mean, I've, I'm already past the halfway point. I've still got a minute to go, so I think, I think I'll think i be alright. Ah, I think... The, <laughs> the, the, the challenge comes from the fact that there's nitro everywhere. Oh shit. And it's a it's kind of a maze as well. Oh Jesus Christ, these hitboxes. There we go, right. There we go. Can I get five in twenty-five seconds? I don't actually know, maybe not. Hmm. Oh I don't think I'm doing it. Oh, wait, there's the three. I see them. Nah, I'm not doing it. It's too far away. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I, I, I need to, I need to stop making a habit of cutting these things so fucking close. <laughs> Good. Oh, unbelievable. Yes, I know it's a square battle map, but it's amazing that in the terms of all the walls that you can run into. Um, thank you, um, Veltacan, for the subscription. That's very kind of you. Right, so now we have to move on. Hope because this is the last world, hopefully we can just go straight back to where we were a second ago. I think Oxide's world is... Oh, no. Okay, yeah, so we go back to the igloo. And then we take a right once we get out, which will take us back to Insanity Beach. 
I like this little world layout. It's cute. Although I will say Diddy Kong Racing's over overworld is better. I will say that. I like it here and it's cute and it's fun to zip around and it's fun to see all the sights, but the fact that there's actual shit to do and things to see and like special things to unlock in the um, in Diddy Kong's overworld is what makes it special. All right, Gemstone Valley, that's the name of the thing. All right. Okay, let's save the game again. Also, placeholder, thank you for 200 bits. What do you call it when Crash Bandicoot has to quickly hide his Wii before the cops show up? Stash Team Racing. <laughs> Stash Bandicoot. Okay, right. Exit. Now, there's a, there's a few things riding on this race. First of all, this this if I beat this race on my first time, this will be the first perfect adventure mode racing thing I've ever done where I haven't lost a single time. But also, I desperately need a Wii. And I kind of want to beat the boss without doing that. I am willing to risk rupturing... I'm willing to risk rupturing a kidney to beat Oxide in one go. So there's a lot riding on this. So don't, don't fuck with me, Oxide, all right? Let me, let me have this one. Also, yes, you, your eyes did not deceive you there. He did skip. He did skip the, um, the countdown there. Not very fair, exactly. But, you know, there we go. Oh yes, I remember. So this is where in every area of the world, yeah. of the of the track rather, this is where he does something different. Yeah, he has a different weapon for every area of the track. There we go. And he doesn't spin out for too long either. But the, because he doesn't spin out for too long, and um, his recovery animation is really quick, that also means that you can kind of knock a few items into him one after the other and you can get away with it. Come on, Oxide, go easy on me. I really need I really need this Wii. I've earned this. Let me let me win and get a flawless adventure mode crash team racing victory and then let me have a reward Wii. If you beat me, and I have to Wii before I finish this game, because that's another thing as well, it won't only be my first ever flawless, oh my god, every race has been done on my first try, including bosses run of Crash Team Racing for PS1. It won't only be that, but it'll be also the first time I've done it all in one sitting and without having to go to the toilet. So this is a big deal right now. This is a really big deal, and I really fucking hope I can do it. This will be a landmark moment in my gaming career. Here's a little surprise! Here, here's a little surprise! I'm not anywhere close to you! <laughs> I'm gonna get, oh, do you know what? If I do that voice, it makes it it makes it rise up. I, I, actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep the oxide voice down to a minimum. Looking at the map, though, it looks like I'm quite far ahead, so I think I'm all right. But you know, never know. You never know. I don't remember him being too difficult in um in Nitro Fueled, so I think actually this must be the harder version of the game. Or I'm just remembering wrong, I don't know. Maybe I'm just fucking great. There's always that possibility. Yeah, I think this race is mine. I'm really far ahead. I'm really far ahead. we go. God, is it possible that we're going to finish this game in like two stream sessions? I think it might be. Oh, he's so far behind. He's, n he's not catching up. He's running into all of my fucking traps. So yeah, as I think I, I know I was, I, was, I was starting to say this earlier. The story of this game makes no fucking sense. So Oxide comes to our planet and is like, I'm going to challenge you all to a race. And if I win, then I'm going to turn the whole world into a big parking lot. And that's like, oh, no, that's sad, right? But the problem is, is that all the boss races all have keys which unlock the race to Oxide. So the bosses are actively trying to turn their own planet into concrete. 
they, they're, like, they're holding the keys to Oxide to beat Oxide to not turn the planet into concrete. Right? So why do we have to... Why don't they use their keys and then we all beat him together? I don't understand. But it doesn't matter because I beat the fucking game flawlessly. I think... Yeah, I lost that, I lost that one time on the um, CTR tokens, but the tokens don't count towards the trophies and the story mode. So I'm fine with that. And I didn't need, I didn't we I did it all in one sitting. What the fuck? I wasn't expecting that. Dorito MC Beef. That's a great name. Thank you for 245 bits. But you didn't get the second coin on the first try. I think the boss's third lap is nerfed. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, no, I was just saying that. But seeing as though that wasn't for a trophy or a boss key, I'm not gonna count that. Because I because because I'm lazy. Sparda, thank you for ten dollars. Um, been watching you when I found your top 10 people in games that probably stink. Keep up the good work. Oh, yeah, I remember that video. That's one of my old top 10s I don't mind too much. Oh, he's doing a nice... Oh, I'm getting a nice river dance from Oxide. Watch him. Watch this. Watch, watch. Watch. What? He's gonna... He's gonna no, come on, do it, do it, do it, do it. No, he's gonna do it. He's gonna do it properly. That was that was him doing it in place. I mean, he's really, really angry about it. Foodly, 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 foodly. God, where are you? There you go. Perfect. I don't need to go for a wee, honey. I need to see the final cutscene. And this is where Oxide goes. And I make a joke in my um in my Crash Bandicoot 4 video that there's something being put in his bum when he makes that noise. <laughs> Doesn't it sound like it? <laughs> We tried that in bed last night, and I told you I didn't like it! Rabid one, thank you for ten gifted subs! Holy shit, that's way too kind of you. Gathered all my time, relics. Until you've collected all of those and raced me again, you'll never be able to claim you are the fastest. This won't be the last time you'll face <laughs> nitrous oxide. Yeah, classic, again. classic final boss. Okay, you beat me one time, but you, you gotta get the rest of the shit first to prove you can beat me. And then that's the thing, you get all the shit and then you beat him and then he just leaves. Like, what's stopping him from turning the earth into a concrete parking lot anyway? Oh, I forgot that that's the original model. That's the original model from the original game doing the crash dance. And you even get to see the crash dance from another angle, which is... Yeah, that's the story mode, yeah. I mean, there's, there's, there's a lot else to do, so we're gonna be doing them in the next stream sessions, but yeah. Look at that! We did good, guys. I think that calls for a win. DJ! 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 Yeah! Dictionary. Come on. Excellent! Yeah, baby. Oh, Morgan. Morgan was involved in this game. <laughs> Mutato Musica, which is actually, yeah, jo yeah, Josh Mansell. That's their, that's their collective group. And not a Japanese man, as I thought when I was a kid. And I think actually uh, only thought when he was a kid as well. Whoa, Cortex turned into Tiny. That effect of that, like, delay effect of the character models, like, leaving an echo behind is really, really horrible. I don't like it. Oh, Oh, Mel Winkler was in this game, bless him. R.I.P. Chip Chinnery. That is the best name I've ever seen. Chip Chinnery, Chip Chinnery, Chip Chin Chiru. I voiced in Crash Bandicoot and I had a poo. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna let myself. I'm gonna sit through the credits like a good boy. You, you, you producer Grady Cunt. Um, assistant producer Donovan Sassetti. Senior producer Perry Winkle. Um, Amy? Oh, are they, is she named? Did they name one of the ladies after her? Amy? A M I? I recognise that name. One of the lady. Banukas that do the um the trophy giveaways. Anyway, I don't know. Do you know what? I, I can't hold it. So what I'm going to do is I'm not going to go into an intermission because there's no point. What I'm going to do instead is um find out who's streaming and then we're going to fucking raid them. How about that? We are going to raid today. Um. Oh, who should we raid? Ashens. Let's raid Ashens. Quiz Kit, apparently, he's, he's playing, whatever the hell that is. But let's raid Ashens. He raids me quite a lot, so I, I, I'll return the favour. 
Ashens is a great guy. If you've ever seen videos about shitty pound, like pound land discount bootleg toys that you get for like 50p in your local town, he's the guy that probably did the video of it. Brown sofa, hands, British voice. Um, he's one of those things where you, you'd see a screenshot of the video, you'd know who he was, but you might not know his name or anything because he doesn't have his face out there too much. But yeah, we'll raid him. I'm gonna go and piss. Um, and I'm gonna, yeah, I feel like Ripperoo right now. I feel like I'm, I'm moving my legs around just like him and I'm jumping around, which is probably not helping my bladder. So I'm gonna go, but you guys enjoy him. I'm gonna hang around there for a second while this stream downloads so I can upload it. And I'll see you in two days time on Friday for the next part of getting this game 100% finished. Bye everybody. Oh, it's at Sushi Goo. That's a great name.